I'm fixing to head out by myself today. I gotta go grind uh, one uh, pine stump. I got it uh, this afternoon. It's actually Sunday and you know Steve's off and it's Memorial Weekend and all that good stuff. And But I'm gonna I gotta run out and do a, a stump for a guy that he's wanting to landscape a yard real quick and and uh, all that good stuff. But while I'm at it I gotta get a spare. I always carry a spare chain um, uh, steel chains in my truck and everything but i buy these to save money i buy these uh, uh 20 at a time or at least 10 at a time because if uh the place i get them at if you buy uh 10 or more uh they'll let you have them for 18 dollars a uh, piece that's for the 25 inch bar so if you want to save money you could always ask your dealer or whoever say hey if i buy 10 or more chains or buy five to eight hundred dollars worth of stuff how much break could you get and, and a lot of them they'll they'll do that and then there's some they won't this chain right here for instance um if i bought it in town it would cost me 44 dollars for this one chain i can get 10 of them for 180 dollars so and it's a identical exact same thing so and it goes on my uh 461 uh chainsaw you know i've had 660s i mean i've had about every saw you can imagine but this 461 has been the best um since i've had it i've had it for like two years man and I, I, that's been one of the best uh saws that i ever ran uh or have and i've got a bunch of them man i mean i've over the years but uh i have not had no problems uh whatsoever out of that saw and i've cut that well that's pretty much all the trees that i ever cut uh, at least here in alabama they're not gonna be uh gigantic by no means on uh you know usually a 25 inch bar will cut everything that you got at least in my area that is and uh very seldom you'll have to throw a three foot or a four foot or whatever bar anything uh more than that uh on a chainsaw and um and cut it down i mean you can i mean but me and you know me and steve we only do you know what we do we do small jobs man that's that's what we're comfortable with and that's what we stick to so but anyway i'm fixing to uh head out i'm gonna check the gas diesel oh yeah take that and uh everything should be good to go here's the job i got to do this afternoon i gotta do this pine stump uh i'm gonna cut it off lower and grind it they're gonna uh redo the landscaping in the backyard so but it's flared out man it's got some it got a couple of places of roots on the other side that's flared out here's here's one right here here's a nub so i'm going to uh i'll take the chainsaw cut it make a flush cut with it first and then uh go to grinding
see i pushed it out of the way to where they can uh the guys where i make sure i got everything see it's got a little a little hill a lump there where it was mounted up you know where the stump was and the roots ra raised all the uh the dirt up to it so i'm trying now i got it pushed out now everything that if it's not high or great i'll, I'll go around and till her up around the edges and uh try to make it great he said he's going to landscape the yard and do stuff like that so it might not matter but just on the safe side where it where he ain't gonna call me back and i know I, th I did a great job or i think i did a great job i'm gonna i'm gonna uh hit around the perimeter of this stump and then uh uh call it a day i got maybe i'll hit that little bit right there and uh but i'll i'll re you know re go at it again uh and i'll know for i'll know that i got it this time
I believe I got her taken care of for the customer. They're going to come in and get rid of this stuff. They're going to put the chunk of wood by the road and that, uh, you know, they're going to deal with that. But, um, yeah, I got to uh, do a little bit of cleaning and raking and everything, but not too much. But, uh, hey, I wanted to point out something that I noticed today while I was doing it. I hit a couple rocks and the limb, uh, the, <clears throat> the chips started getting real stringy. When they start getting, when they start getting stringy like this right here, <laughs> it's time to change, you know, uh, stuff like that, you know, it's that you want to have good, you know, good chips. I mean, you want to have, uh, you know, good small chips when you're chipping this. But if they start getting real long and stringy, your teeth are getting dull and it's time to get some, um, change out your teeth or swap them, turn them. Some of the green teeth you can do like two or three times, you can change them, uh, rotate them, 